Don't hate. <clears throat> Create. Hate is energy <clears throat> with which you can create from. No child should ever have to encapsulate any emotion that they're experiencing, especially when they're conscious of their being present. We got we got we got to give those kids something. We 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 have to. We have to give them something. Yeah. Milk, Cheerios, cereal, eggs and waffles and eggos and Lego my eggos and yes, I get it. That's not enough. Kids need to be fed. They need not to be afraid. The school is teaching the, the, the system will teach them to compete. But you must teach them. You must you much you much. Yeah, very much. You must teach them love. Give them character. Show them something to be conscious of. It's taking care of their teeth. So they'll have them when they get older, you know? Uh, I wasn't told that, so I was fortunate. I caught some of mine and I had to give away some. But long story short, at the end of the day, we give them something to be conscious of, not when we think they're ready. You give it to them on any given moment that you have the life and air in which to breathe, <clears throat> that oxygen, that, that bridge that connects life to consciousness. The, as long as they're breathing, they're ready to be receiving. Stop, stop this, stop this following what society sell. You don't even, you don't really have to feed your child that poison they call milk, that pus, that pus we've all drunk. We've all, some of us were a little less fortunate because it got worse and worse as time went on. No matter how much you homogenate it or pasteurize it, <clears throat> if you don't squeeze that milk from nuts, in your own kitchen, you don't know what you're drinking. I didn't drink milk for about 15 years. <clears throat> Tried soy, oi, everything with which they chose to toy, and, you know, that kind of thing. Oh, you can taste the fakeness. <clears throat> Simply because I became aware of a few things. I was told to see. Not told to believe what I was told to believe. I was told to see what I was allowed to see not dictated to, not told to see what I was told to see. I was allowed to actually see how changing and going from, <clears throat> that's another video. The kids need to know because had I not known, I may have just left milk alone. But milk is really like meat. There's no meat in a cow or a bull or a deer. Okay, we've eaten it. Yeah, oh yeah. That's flesh, no matter how you look at it. Mankind will tell you it's meat because that's more delight. It, 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 it'll sell better. Meat is in the nuts, the watermelon, the fruits. You, you get it? That middle part where it, it's all taking place before it ripens and over ripens. It, 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 you see? That's meat and nuts. There's milk and nuts. <clears throat> life, life would have been so much nicer had I known this at the age of nine or 10. We could do this for kids. We could have kids thinking like I can think now. I don't know everything, but I can think critically. I can question. We need our kids before they reach the age of 10 to know that they're conscious and their consciousness comes from each breath they take. So, therefore, giving them the wherewithal, giving them the information that they possess the wherewithal, so whenever they need it at all. <clears throat> it, it's very important, very important. Touch their spirit, touch their soul. Those gifts you give them, those are sold. Those are sold and bought and purchased. Give them the key to the joy or the toy inside. Give them 
something to be conscious of. Not not when you think if you Google Gaga Gaga you from there on when you get a Gaga Google Gaga got back, that child is aware and there and spiritually prepared for everything. Don't you dare deny a child the the truth that they deserve. Don't you dare deny a child the right to dream. Don't you dare deny a child to believe that they are the hope of their future, regardless of what the future may hold. They must know that they are present and consciousness is the big, the biggest part, is the meat, the heart of, of their presence. Consciousness from the spirit connected to the divine intelligence that put all of this together in the first place. Our children have it. So do we. We're just so bombarded with everything else we've been conditioned to see. Let's work with the kids. They deserve a chance to. Peace, guys.